Hi, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to password protect a folder on Windows 11. So, first of all, of course, you would like to go and open your PC that contains the Windows 11. And of course, if you're a Windows 10 user, you can just go into your settings and actually operate into Windows 11 for free. And you can even run the installation of Windows 11 on the background of your PC, and you can use your PC in the meanwhile without any problems. Of course, it could, could be a bit slower, but it's not going to be a big deal. And of course, once the installation finished, you'll be notified by, to restart or to reboot your PC. And once you do that, you will find your Windows 11 ready to use. And of course, you'll even have a recovery point if you want to go back into your original place, which is going to be your Windows 10. But I bet you will stay on Windows 11 because you will like it. So, uh, as we said, we would like to password protect a folder on the Windows 11. So the first thing we would like to do is just to open the file that we would like to look. So let me just open here my files. And let's say as an example, uh, let's just go here into documents. Yeah, and let's say as an example, I would like to uh, look this EOLIS file. So simply the first thing I would like to do is just go into the file and right click on it. Then of course you would like to click uh, to go into properties and once i am here of course i would like to click on this advanced button on the general section and once i do that make sure to check this encrypt content to secure data and then click add ok and now click at apply changes and of course you have chosen to make the following att uh, attributes changes do you want to apply the changes to this folder only or do you want to apply it for all subfolders or file as well of course if you want to put it just for this folder make sure to apply changes to this folder only and click at ok and now click at ok again or sorry you will have to uh, i made a mistake you'll have to choose this apply changes to this folder and subfolders and file click at ok now click at apply and as you can see it will apply all the folders, all the folders inside this folder, especially, and you will have to wait a bit until everything is finished. Of course, do not click at cancel, so it will take about just ten seconds, five, and now once it's finished, click at OK, and your folder, as you can see, it will contain an icon here. That means it's closed, or it 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 is protected. So this is actually for this tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching, and goodbye.